Yeah. Thank you, members. Mr. Oh, Mr. Speaker. Yeah. Colin King. Thank you, Mr. Speaker. On the third reading of the Taxation Canterbury Earthquake Measures Bill, it's um, good to see that it's uh, been well considered and well canvassed. It's a sensible, pragmatic, and compassionate and fair uh, attempt by the Income Tax Act to consider the full circumstances uh, that have happened in Canterbury and in Christchurch. When we look at the Act in general, it is an anti-avoidance bill or anti-avoidance act, so therefore it is fair and reasonable that it does provide the relief uh, that Christchurch so, so admirably has deserved. So we look forward to Christchurch returning to its former glory. The dislocation and the, is on a phenomenal scale and uh, we look forward to a speedy recovery, although we do recognise uh, that that will take some time and that there is a lot of pain and suffering down there. So I commend the bill to the House. Members, the question is that the motion be agreed to. Those of that opinion will say aye. aye. Contrary, no. The ayes have it. Taxation, Canterbury Earthquake Measures Bill, third reading. Members, I wish you all a happy and enjoyable two-week recess. The House stands adjourned until 2pm on Tuesday the 7th of June 2011.